Searchers today found the body of a man swept away in the flash floods Sunday in Maryland. Edison Herman was 39, an Air Force vet and a National Guardsman. Jeff Pegues was there today as those who live and work in Ellicott City got a first look at what's left of their homes and businesses. I can already see the floor starting to warp again. When the floodwaters came racing down Main Street, Jason Barnes' toy store didn't stand a chance. The water was up to the ceiling. Yeah, and then some it looks like. I mean, Leaving yeah, a basement swear. full of toys down underwater. Where do you start the cleanup? I don't know. I don't know if anything in here will be salvageable. Like many here, Barnes has no flood insurance. And also, like many others here, he spent much of his savings rebuilding after Ellicott City flooded two years ago. They say this flood is worse. On Sunday, the water came rushing down Main Street. And as it progressed down the street, it took the sidewalk with it, with the water up to the top of some of these doors. The water ran so fast, some shops went from dry to flooded in just minutes. Everyone's going to start having to ask those hard questions. Can we stay? This time around, Jason says he's not sure he will. Jeff Begay, CBS News, Ellicott City, Maryland.